Hey, all my Go High Level peeps. So I had shared a um, kind of GIF of a script I had created to autocomplete addresses for teams that use appointment setters within Go High Level, right? So it's really easy to set up like address autocomplete on like teams, but inside of Go High Level itself, uh, I was struggling a little bit, so I had to figure it out in a few hours. But basically what it allows you to do is um, have your team start typing the mystery address for an appointment they're setting, and then it'll give them options to select and allow them to auto complete that address so that you know, one, the details are correct, because my team kept misspelling addresses, which happens, I did it. And then two, just making it easier for them to get that address verified with the homeowner or whatever it is, and then lock it in. So what I wanted to do today is I had a lot of people saying, like, cool, can I get that code? And then I get, shared the code, and then they're like, cool, how do I install it? So just wanted to walk through both of those steps real quick. Below is the code. I'll drop a link to it so you'll have everything you need. All you need to do, right, to install this is come into your uh, Go High Level Agency Level account. And um, give me one sec. Cool. And then from there, you want to go to settings. And then let me pause this real quick, make sure I don't have any uh, details that I shouldn't check. Also, there was some stuff I needed to remove, so I'm glad I checked first. But um, it just had some API keys that I shouldn't share. So basically, what you're going to want to do is just come to this page. You can copy the code, right? You're going to go into your agency account, right? You're going to go to settings. And then you're going to go to company level. And then there's a place for you to paste in JavaScript, right? And so for that, you're going to want to come in, paste it in and then go from there, right? Once you come down here, you'll hit save or update company. I don't need to do that because I actually host all my scripts on a custom uh, object storage on Linode. So this is where my scripts host and it calls it from there. But you'll hit that, hit save. And then when you go into any location, what'll happen, um, let me just do a test account. Hopefully I have it open to all accounts still, but we'll see. Um, you go to a test account, right? And let me pause because my phone number is going to be in here. Cool. And so now when you come into a contact, I just created one so that my uh, personal details weren't out there on the internet, right? You can start typing in an address. And then this is my office, for example, right? You type it in, click, and then hit save, and the address is fully stored. So I hope that helps. If you guys have any questions around that, feel free to let me know. And then I'll drop a link to the code below if you guys need that.